Hey guys, welcome to episode 7 of my Road to Glory series. Still using the same squad, our first opponent of the day has a nice uh, Bundesliga squad. The same left side as my squad actually, and I uh, saw Aguero Royce over there. An amazing squad, and I think that is better than mine actually. But Remy here, uh, true on the wing, nice body paint, gets one on one with the goalkeeper, but that's an amazing save by Neuer. The counter attack here with the pass to Remy, one on one with the goalkeeper. But fails to finish yet again, and it's still 0 0 at the 33rd minute already. With Schweinsteiger here, a nice cross on Remy, and was finally able to get the 1 to nail in there, which you do deserve uh, really much. Just before half time, some nice combination player, Di Maria, true. But I decided to shoot over there, and maybe should have done uh, something else, but we do get the corner kick. And my corner kick method, first taking it short, proved to be dangerous again. You get another corner kick, short corner kick, uh, turn it, put that into the box at the first post and Quadrado is going to head it in, 42 to nil. Second half now, nice ball roll there and it, I think that should have been a penalty kick but we do not get it. But we get the ball back uh, very quickly, Quadrado takes it over there, scoop turn to body feint, just like in the wiggle tutorial, sneaky through ball and a nice ground cross there by Di Maria for the easy 3 to nil tap in over there by Remy. Nice uh, touch here by Di Maria, a little touch to the back line, then the ground cross and it's an easy, easy goal for Remy to score. Nice pass here to Quadrado. Face of dribbling, confuses our opponent and to shoot that at the first post. Look at that, face of dribbling over there. Very, very nice by Quadrado. And then we finish and even Neuer cannot save that. After he had some amazing saves, it turned out to be 14 0 anyway. Our next opponent, Higuain. Uh, Ericsson on the left side, Isco has a CDM, I cannot believe why does he have Isco as CDM on that uh, squad. Doesn't fit in uh, with chemistry, doesn't fit in at the CDM place. I, I don't know what he's doing, but our first opportunity of the match, we missed that uh, from approximately 3-4 meters, a very big miss, but Quadrado here threw on the wing. Of course it's at in yet again, the ball is going to get to Royce, passes it back. And to try to get through there, Schweinsteiger, nice fake shot. And somehow I put that wide, I cannot believe that that was not a goal. Already in the 36th minute, Remy one on one. And also he is gonna miss uh, one on one with the goalkeeper. Some very big misses this episode. But the ball gets to Royce here after a nice combination. And we finally get the opener over there. The goal kick of the throw with the goalkeeper. Looks like an opportunity for a counter attack. And how about that double roulette by Remy? Gets the ball to Quadrado. And if your player is going to perform a sliding shot, usually they tend to be so overpowered. And I, I don't know how EA uh, made it to be the sliding shot to be that powerful, but it's the way it is. But look at that ball roll to drag by combination of Di Maria. Absolutely amazing assist over there. Uh, it's worth a replay definitely, look at that uh, drag back over there, you do not see the ball roll in the uh, replay but that was an amazing assist right there. The uh, free kick over there, some passing play, first that fake shot, Quadrado 1-on-1, one -on -one. Uh, I think I tried a little bit too much there with the ball roll, but we do get the corner kick and we use the same method again, first we take it short and then cross that into the first post and that results in the rage quit and the 4-0 over there. Our next opponent of today's episode is Scott Hassar on the right, I don't know why he's done that, uh, but he has Di Maria, it's quite an okay squad, but uh, I think my squad is better than his one, uh, to be fair, I don't know why he has uh, Hassar on the right and that other girl on the left, it doesn't really make sense, but the interception here with Ramirez, Pot Quadrado, pass to Remy, we get a little bit lucky there that we get the ball back, or it's a very bad play of my opponent, just how you want to interpret that, it doesn't make sense for him to uh, start a dribble over there, he should have just passed it back to the goalkeeper, but we missed the opportunity, and we're already in the 15th minute of the match now, Schweinsteiger spots the run of Remy, gives him the ball, and it's a difficult angle, but somehow Remy manages to put that into the back of the net, an amazing finish over there, because that was not really an easy opportunity to finish. Quadrado first touch fake shot, Di Maria does the same, spots Remy over there and look at that, I pressed shoot, I pressed shoot but I don't know what Royce is doing, 
and after that I mess up because I expected him to shoot and I really cannot believe uh, why didn't he shoot you can see the bar above his head that's why I slowed it down a bit but okay let's get on with the match now Timo here gets a little bit lucky there but that pass was amazing but somehow even that did not end up in the back of the net the 40 second minute already where Di Maria gets the ball, nice passing play, Borges to Quadrado and I fail to finish yet again. Some really big misses this episode but we are gonna get the goal here with a nice low pass to Remy and finally the 2-0 just before half time, uh, very well deserved I think. Di Maria passes it to Remy, maybe it not have been the best uh, choice to go for there but the pass here to Royce Face the privilege protecting the ball, the drag back. First like fade shot with Remy, and I think that was a great goal right there. The 3 to nil, uh, the persist of the face of dribbling there. Nice pass to Remy. Look at the combination play here. The ball gets back to Di Maria. Remy gets the ball, and I cannot believe that he did not put that into the back of the net. But we get the corner kick again, and we're gonna cross it in on Quadrado, I think it was, and he has it in 44 to nil. Uh, right from the kickoff, we intercept the ball. And the boss is gonna get back to Royce. That's a first touch, low pass. Well, great overview there by Royce to give that first touch. And this time Remy does not fail on the finish. 5 to 0 indeed. We mess up with the free kick over there. It's fine Steiger with great overviews. Possibly space at Quadrado. Nice good turn. Finish at the first post and 6 to 0. And now the 85th minute. Di Maria here with the ball. Gives it back to Remy. And can he beat the goalkeeper? Yes, he can beat the goalkeeper. 7 to nil actually already and can we even get more goals maybe we can because uh, Royce here with the ball is gonna do a nice dribble face up dribbling here the fake shot drag back another time the fake shot and we do not get the goal there but I think it was a great dribble and it certainly did deserve a goal can we get the 8 nil after all oh, no because Ramirez is gonna hit the ball and that is gonna be the end of this match already and now the last match of this episode a lot of special cards 88 rated Tevez uh, 86 rated Vidal and Pogba Cellini over there in form a lot of special cards he got um, 84 rated striker Mario Gomez over there it's a kind of nice squad but I think even though all the informs I think my squad is the better one uh, Remy is 80 rated but he's a really great player to play with and it shows right here the one to nil just a simple fake shot and we get one on one with the goalkeeper and uh, some very bad defending here way too aggressive of me I'm underestimating uh, my opponent a little bit because he's not really that good and I was too aggressive there in the defense and that was really really terrible I need to stay focused and do not take this too easily again just a simple fake shot and we can get one on one just like in the tutorial if your opponent cannot defend them, then he's going to have a really, really bad match if you use that. Royce has some face of dribbling, then crosses it in on Remy, but we get the own goal there actually. The own goal there just before half time, 1 2 3, and we got back into the match. We are going to win this easily. And the low pass to Royce, nice there. The Berber spin, just the skill move we needed over there. Pass that to Remy, and another time, an own goal. What a coincidence! two own goals in a row in one match Royce with some skill moves over there and gives the ball to Alaba nice there the face of the body feint turn face shot another time the body feint what an amazing action ball roll he gets through very lucky there but we do get the goal there five to one I think we got lucky on the end with the finishing part but uh, the builder before that all those actions were really nice and I think that they did deserve a goal uh, well we missed an opportunity here but William here gets the ball with the body feint, spots the space at Walker and it looks like an opportunity to cross but he goes for the chip through ball and we do not uh, manage to put that ball into the net but we get the ball back uh, very quickly and Royce over here with the body feint through on the wing and are we going to cross it in this time some nice face up dribbling and Royce is going to go himself now he passes it to uh, Quadrado over there or William, I stopped him William already and we, this time not an own goal, we actually scored it ourselves, 46 to 1. And now uh, the last opportunity of the match I think, we're going to cross it in on Remy this time, 47 to 1. And that is how the match is going to end, and that's already the end of this episode. 30 wins in a row, and next episode we're going to 
see if we can win the Division 5 title. And we're gonna get into Division 4 after that episode, that things uh, may finally get more interesting. But this is the end of this episode. If you like this type of content, want more Road to Glory series, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to my channel. This was Suti, see you next time.